somebody recently posted on Facebook a YouTube video that is from California, of course, um, and in it a Sacramento City Council woman from District 2 is mentioned, or gives a little blurb, uh, Sandy Sheedy. She says, quote, there's been a lot of people that have been shot by an unloaded gun, and whether it's loaded or not, it still presents a threat. Well, this sounds like a prime experiment for me, so I decided to test whether or not you can be shot with an unloaded gun. Um, I'm going to do this a very scientific way, using the scientific method. Um, the first step is to gather information, and uh, using background information that I've gathered over the years, I've shot several guns. Um, I've never had an unloaded gun discharge, uh, either at me or away from me, or in my general vicinity. vicinity. Um, second step is the hypothesis. I have, I, according to this councilwoman, and I'll test her hypothesis, it is possible to get shot with an unloaded gun. So to test this, I decided to have an unloaded gun and um, I have an unloaded gun here in pieces to prove that is that it is unloaded. As you can see, there is no round in the chamber. You can see right through the whole barrel. And it goes on this way. Have the slide. Also, no rounds whatsoever in it. And because of one of the safety features on here, it has to have the magazine inserted for it to fire. Um, so I have an unloaded magazine. No bullets, just the holder. So, and it is a fully, it is a fully operational gun. As you can see, a pen goes straight through the barrel. Close it. Won't fire. Put an empty magazine in check to make sure that the pen is still there. Yep. It is a working gun. So now for the hypothesis testing, because just in case there is a possibility of the unloaded gun shooting me, I've decided to let this bottom of the fish tank with me There's me. A little bit hard to see, but oh well, you get the point. So, Mr. Fish Tank me is going to represent me. This gun is going to represent an unloaded gun, because it is an unloading gun. Another check. No bullets. Nothing in the chamber. Nothing's coming out. Still no bullets. And to be on the safe side, Ear protection and eye protection. Ready? I'm going to test this ten times. Unloaded gun one, Sacramento Council, me council member zero. By the way, um, I am shooting in a safe direction. Out that direction is outside and the ground. So nobody is really in danger unless they're outside running around where they shouldn't be. It's too cold out. So, still unloaded gun. Still unloaded. Test number two. Unloaded gun two. Council member zero. And it is a double action shield, so I'll just shoot from here from now on. Three. Four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Well, I think that, that pretty much concludes that at least this gun, when unloaded, cannot be discharged at someone or in someone's vicinity. But in the off chance that I might have had a faulty unloaded gun, I decided to test another gun. I have a Mac 90 here. It as you can see, my Mac ninety is unloaded. 
There is no magazine. This gun does not need a magazine to fire, like the Bursa did. Okay. Safety glasses. All right. No magazine. Still unloaded. Didn't fire. Still unloaded. This one you need to uh, rack it to get the fire or the. This one you need to rack to get the hammer back. Still unloaded. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Well, I think it's, at least according to my testing, uh, you're certainly free to test your own um, hypothesis or test this hypothesis, whichever one you choose. You're free to conduct your own experiments, uh, but I cannot be held responsible if you are shot with an unloaded gun. Good luck.